Whether it's the cha-cha-cha, the salsa, or an elegant waltz, no dance steps appear too difficult for this group of disabled people in Beijing. They're members of the only wheelchair dance school in China. Founded in 2009, the dancers are able to maneuver with ease, grace, and speed. They train three times a week and take part in international competitions. But these moves are more than just for fun. I think dancing is good. It gives them self-confidence, improves their body agility, and dancing stimulates their learning abilities. When she's on the dance floor, Li Ting is able to escape the limits of her wheelchair. She can spin, glide and dance. For a few hours, her chair becomes a part of her. There are 85 million disabled people in China. Li Ting caught polio when she was a baby. She never took her first steps and couldn't go to school because the building didn't have the right facilities. So she decided to learn for herself. And today, at 22 years old, she works from home as a web editor, having studied graphic design and fine arts. When I'm dancing, I forget all restrictions. If I want to spin, I spin. If I want to run, I run. I completely forget that I'm disabled. She got her driving license in Beijing just two years ago, and the car has brought new freedom. Three times a week, she drives to the Academy of Fine Arts and learns all the secrets of painting. She has a dream of being an illustrator for children's books. Everyone wants a better life, no matter how your body is. Maybe people who can walk admire me because of everything I do, but I really think that we are equal. I want to enjoy life and do what I want. But only 12% of disabled people living in Chinese cities can access aid facilities. Learning World, in association with WISE, an initiative of Qatar Foundation.